Can you describe exactly what is river blindness? River blindness is a skin and eye disease caused by a worm, a parasite, which is transmitted by a black fly. And why do we call it river blindness? Because the uh, black fly which transmits the disease breed in uh, fast running waters and not a very oxygenated water. So wherever you have falls or rapids, the risk of having these black flies in the tropics is very high. Therefore, people who live close to those rivers, especially close to the rivers, uh, to the falls and rapids, the risk of getting the disease is very high because the vector which transmit the disease breed there. And, and the treatment of it, how do you go about preventing the spread of it, uh, preventing people from, from catching this disease? I think uh, we have uh, two major strategies currently. The first one, you kill the vector. How can you kill it? By just widespreading uh, an insecticide, which can kill the vector. And that strategy was used in 11 countries in West Africa very successfully for almost uh, 20, more than 25 years. And today, people have gone back to the valleys, the river basins where they had these uh, black flies. But this strategy is very, very, very expensive because uh, in West Africa, they had used uh, uh, airplanes, helicopters to spread the insecticide. And since 1987, uh, Mechtison Merck has donated a drug which kills uh, part of the parasite, especially the, 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 the baby worms. And uh, this drug is called Mechtison, and it's very effective, and, uh, and it's going to be useful until we found uh, another drug which can kill the adult worm will be uh, discovered. So right now, we are using that drug to distribute it massively to the community in order to cut off. Uh, Actually, uh, in general, worldwide, river blindness is one of the fifth major blinding diseases. The first one, of course, is cataract, and uh, it's followed depending whether or not you're in developing or in uh, developed countries. You may have, uh, in developing countries, we have infectious diseases, astrachoma, or, or uh, river blindness. And we have also vitamin A deficiency. We have also glaucoma as a major cause of blindness. And these days, also, we have refractive errors, which require uh, you know, corrections with the optical uh, glasses. And, and how is direct relief helping you tackle those issues? Direct relief has really helped me in, uh, in improving the uh, health facilities, and that's critical. Uh, these days, you know, f uh, after the war which broke in, uh, to in 1996, most of the health uh, infrastructures have collapsed, so direct relief is very critical in uh, helping us uh, in terms of improving these uh, health facilities with medical equipment, which is a basic, a, a big problem in a, in a post-conflict uh, country or area.